Hey folks, Carl from Carl's Custom Guitars here. Today I'm going to be taking one of my six string electric cigar box guitars for a little bit of a test drive. This is the deluxe two pickup model. It has two GHS humbucking pickups, one volume, one tone with a coil tap on the tone control which splits the humbuckers down to single coils. Also have a three way switch. I also make this model with just the single bridge pickup, which of course wouldn't have the three-way switch, but still has the volume control, tone control, and the coil tap. All of my cigar box guitars have the real opening body, which reveals the solid mahogany interior body, and of course all the electronics, and you could even put some cigars in there or whatnot. I'm going to be doing a little bit of cross-promoting here today. I'm going to be running this through a Fender Blues Junior amp over here, which has been rehoused in one of my Carl's Custom Guitars Dovetail Pine replacement cabinets. This is like the first one I made over a dozen years ago. Hundreds of gigs on this thing, still sounds great. Huge improvement in tone when you replace that crappy particle board cab with a real pine cabinet. So otherwise, it's a totally stock amp. I'm also going to be running it through one of my speaker soak power attenuators. This goes in between the speaker output and the speaker itself. This is an 8 ohm model, which matches the Fender Blues Junior. You always want to match the ohms. Will work on any amp 60 watts or under. These are amazing. Let you crank the amp up, get those tubes really pumping, and then roll the volume back to a respectable level that your neighbors won't call the cops on you or something but still preserve that open tube tone. So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to set all the controls on the amp at noon, put a little splash of reverb. Normally that would be really loud, but once again, I'm going to bring this into play and it'll roll things back to a reasonable level, but still sound wide open. You still get those power tubes really pumping. I'll probably roll this back to about one third. So uh, I already got it hooked up over there, but this is what it's going to look like. Yeah, one third. Okay. Let's hear what we've got here. Uh, starting off, bridge pickup, humbucker, everything up. single coil. So we have vintage Cluson style split key tuners, that classic look, skunk stripe on the back of the neck, 
Telecaster style neck with, of course, the ashtray Telecaster style bridge. We have solid brass compensated saddles, so it has that vintage style look, but your intonation is nice and in. Hand rubbed body with the painted on F holes, corner pieces on all the corners, and even has rubber feet on the bottom here that act as its own guitar stand when you lean it up against something. Strap buttons, basically everything you see here is included. Really, really cool guitars. Let's just play it a little bit more. Thanks, folks.